<laughs> Guys, I just dropped $120 on a oh, It's here! It's here! This is $125 fly swatter. Are you stupid or something? Okay, technically not really a fly swatter, but it does kill flies. Let's open it up and see what I got here. Behold the bug assault shredder. If you're not familiar with bug assault, for years they've sold these pump action salt shooting guns to kill flies and I've had several of these for years and they are freaking amazing. One of the main differences between the shredder and the original bug assault is that the shredder takes CO2 cartridges. As shipped it comes with five CO2 cartridges, the shredder, and two sets of ammo. That's one issue with this new bug assault gun is that you do have to buy their proprietary ammo, but it's not expensive. This is I think 12 bucks for the pack and there's 120 rounds in it. Two of those and some instructions and yeah, we know what we do with instructions, don't we? Let's talk about build quality. So overall, this is mostly plastic, the, you know, the, what would be the barrel and the grips. The frame is metal, and this thing's actually pretty hefty. The trigger is metal, as well as the hammer, and I'm gonna break it open. So here's one of the ammo packs, if you will. You can see it's got the salt rounds there. Now, to put the CO2 cartridge in, looks like I got a notch here, cover my face so it'll focus, notch there, and that just pulls off. One thing I do want to mention is, for one thing, Bug Assault did not send this to me. I paid for this with my own money, and these things have been on back order like every time I have checked. For like two months they've been sold out of these things, and I was even on the email list for whenever they get them back in stock, and I got one of the last emails that I got, I went on within an hour, I noticed the email, went on to purchase it, and uh, they were sold out already. So the last time I happened to be on my phone when the email came through, I purchased it immediately, and here we are today. I guess actually I should take both, hand, both sides of the grip off. And basically this works like an air gun, because <laughs> that's what it is. Just fire salt. All right, get the CO2 cartridge in and then Now if you have small hands, this grip might be kind of big for you. It's actually pretty comfortable for me. This does have a safety on it right here. Push safe or push fire. And of course we want it on fire because we're gonna shoot this bad boy. I'm your Huckleberry. Real quick, I'm just gonna test out how this works by shooting it into this bird bath. And uh, hey, let's go double action. Not impressive. Single action. There we go. Double action again. Single action. Seems to work better on single action. Now, in order to truly appreciate the capabilities of such a device, I shall endeavor to find some flies. And what better way to do that than to leave the back door open for a small period of time. While said flies are accumulating in the house, I'm gonna take the shredder and I'm going to attach my GoPro to the front of it. And let's see if we can get some slow-mo footage of fly deaths. Okay, nothing better than that, folks. A few open containers and a Delicious banana peel should help do the trick. We have victim number one. Oh, <laughs> oh my goshness. Where did that fly go? I believe I sent him into the next realm. Let's find another one. Hello, little friend. Goodbye, little friend. Uh, there's some remnants on there. Let's see if I can find him. 
the problem is I'm trying to get the shot with the slow motion camera. And there you go. He gone. But uh, I can see his little juicy bits hanging out the back over there, but he gone. Okay, so we did not send him into the quantum realm like I think we did those other two. Oh, I just saw, oh, he, oh, he's trying to come back. He's, 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 he's twitching. Oh, oh, no. Hey, let... No, sir. No, sir. When I say a fly is dead, a fly is dead. Oh, my, okay, all right, all right, my bad. Okay, let me, let, oh! Ew. He gone. That's a dead fly right there. Oh, let me just clean up this orange juice real quick. I lock it. I lock it a lot. Oh, he bounced back and hit me in the face. There he is right there. He's right there on the ground. All right, let's see what kind of damage it does against this foil. In other videos I've seen, foil seems to be the preferred uh, target. One of the things they advertise is that you can shoot them, I think, for like three feet away. So let's do a three foot shot first and see what happens. You wanna shoot the fly? You wanna shoot the fly? Okay, you shoot the fly. Okay, you know how to aim. Kill that fly! Ooh, okay, there we go. Battle damage! So we got a pretty good spread here, and you can see we've got some penetration there through the tin foil. But uh, let's get a little bit more realistic because I think most of the time, you know, I can probably get within a foot. So let's see what kind of damage we get. You want to shoot it from a foot? Oh, holy moly. I mean, like, literally, holy. That fly ain't going nowhere. Uh, let's compare that to the original bug assault. Let's go for it. Let's see what she'll do. Okay, so let's try three feet away. I'm just gonna shoot right over here to the side. Okay? Can you see that camera person? Three feet away. Here we go. So we got some indentions there, but nothing went through. All right, let me get about a foot away. We ready? Oh, yeah, see. All right, let's get real close. Again. Oh, see, finally got, finally got it through there. But you see how close it had to be. All right, now let's try that with the, uh, see, see, we got a little fly right there. Oh, that's it, didn't go through that time. That's weird. There we go. One more. Oh, right in the old eyeball. Eyeball number two. Friends, it ain't cheap, but it is a lot of fun. And if you've got a fly problem, I highly recommend the Bug Assault Shredder for I your problem. Anyway, I'll see you next time.